So today it's Christmas Day and we just went and had breakfast. Today we're in Phnom Penh. James is playing shitty music in the background. Yeah, so we're, <laughs> so we're gonna go do a city tour of Phnom Penh and then have lunch somewhere. And after that, we're gonna go to S21 and the Killing Fields. Um, sounds kind of weird, but I'm actually looking forward to going back to them because they're really sad places and they tell a lot of history and I just think it's really good to kind of know about that stuff. So we're at the Cambodia Genocide Museum. I'm not really going to film a lot in here because I, I think you just need to kind of pay attention to an experience. I'm so happy that she's got a lemon meringue pie for dessert. <laughs> You're such a tag. <laughs> okay, so after we went to the killing fields, we went to the um, it's called the Russian markets, and then we went to um, have lunch, and it was really nice. Like we had like a kind of Western kind of thing, and I we'll put all that stuff in after this because I just think it looks silly if you got talking music, talking music. So just try to have all the talking and then all the soundless clips. Um, after that, we kind of, we went to S21, um, I just, I didn't want to film in there because I feel like it's a bit disrespectful, I think they're kind of just places that you should just try to just be present and absorb where you are and what actually happened there, and at the moment we're just at the, um, the National Museum, but Again, can't really film in there, but this is the gardens and it's quite pretty, so that's it. So we're at the Wat Phnom Historic Site, probably said that wrong. Um, we were walking through here last night and, well, we had to go walk through here last night, we didn't really have to pay for it. And then the guys were like yelling at Dad to, for him to come back and pay for it. Okay. <laughs> so please, the lady and gentlemen, before you climb up this hill, I would like... Okay, so it's called, apparently it's called Wat Phnom, I said it wrong before. But basically, what means Buddhist temple and Phnom means on a hill. So, this really rich lady called Pen, apparently, um, ordered to have this hill built after they found some Buddhas. I think it was like up there. Um, so, the soldiers built the hill and they made a Buddhist temple. So, basically, Phnom Pen's named after this hill because it's like Phnom, meaning hill, Pen which is the name of the lady who paid for it to be built. And James getting a photo done. Bye dad.
today's our second day, full day in Phnom Penh. Um, we're just having it, it's a pretty easy day. Like, we're just, this is really bad lighting. Um, we just had breakfast and then we're going to go on a walk in the streets and go to like the central market. And then after that, I think we're just going to come back and go to the gym and like go in the sauna and all that stuff. This hotel doesn't have a pool, which is a bit annoying, but it's all right. And maybe get a massage later. And then at I think it's 3 30, we're going to get picked up and go on a um, I have like a cruise down, sunset cruise down the river. So, pretty cruisy day. Just gonna chill out a bit. Maybe read. And yeah. <laughs> Today we're going to be flying to Vietnam. So we've got two flights. We've got to fly to from the airport. We gotta to fly to Vietnam through this security airport or something. And then we fly to Ho Chi Minh. I'm just gonna do my makeup whilst I'm talking. Um so shit, we're almost Um, so yeah, but we had a bit of an issue with 
light center. So, um, what happened was we were going to get off the boat at Howlong Bay at 11 o'clock in the morning, but then we wouldn't have been able to fly to our next place until 7 o'clock that night. So we would have had heaps of hours just hanging around with our bags. So obviously we wanted that fixed because you don't want to be hanging around for hours with all your bits and pieces. So yeah, I'm trying to contact Flight Centre. It's been it's a bit hard because like Dad tried to email last night but didn't get a reply like so we're gonna get James to call but then decided that I don't know I, I just Natasha mentioned it like we could just um, send a message on Facebook which they replied to basically instantly so it hasn't been resolved yet but at least like they know so they can fix it but yeah, so today we're just going to pack our bags, go to the airport, and um, fly to Hanoi. And I've got to edit this. Okay, so next up, Vietnam.